one. Shut up. Go ahead. Uh, yeah, it was just, um, just one and I. Yo! Nice, dad! You've killed him. <laughs>Who do you think killed Nolan? I think Caleb Michael Verhagen killed Nolan because that man carries some hatred in his heart and there is just things that him and Nolan have gotten arguments about that people shouldn't get in arguments about and I just think all that hatred was built up inside of him and I think he just snapped. After the lights went out, did you see or hear something that makes you think that? I did. Where Caleb was sitting in that general area of the room, I heard movement, and then all of a sudden I heard loud, heavy footsteps. And Caleb is a heftier man, so I just assumed, and everything's all adding up, that just makes me lean towards Caleb being the murderer. Why Nolan? Who do you think killed Nolan? I'll tell you what I saw. I'm walking in the room. And I see how. See Ashley. Ashley Cup. She went out. I knew she was there because I uh, talked to her that morning. We uh, had the coffee. And uh, you know she went that way. Here, here, stop. I just knew, I knew it was that. When the lights turned off, did you see or eat, hear anything that makes you think that? Yeah. I saw when I got the room, and in the moonlight, it is skin perfect. I could see only a face. She had that look on her eye. That look you to make when you know you do something bad. Something you don't do. Something you don't do, especially to the family. I just knew right there. Family. Who do you think killed no one? I think it's that Andrew Parker guy. He had something going on. They were fighting, mumbling. I don't, I don't know what they were doing, but they were fighting before tonight. I think that's who killed him. Is there something you saw or heard that makes you think that? Um, I actually kind of smelled something instead. It was like his cologne. It's really a strong cologne. It could have been Axe cologne. That stuff stinks. Who do you think killed Nolan? Who do I think killed Nolan? I think it was his roommate, James Shuey. I think he killed Nolan because Nolan doesn't keep his room very clean. And James, James loves a clean room. So I think it finally got to him and James was just over it. Done. Did not want Nolan to be around anymore. He couldn't, he couldn't handle it. He threw away his futon yesterday. Next thing, he throws away Nolan. Gone. After the lights went out, did you see or hear anything that makes you think that? I don't know. I heard these big, heavy footsteps when the lights were out, but there are two options of killers with those footsteps. Um, I heard, I don't know, I saw James in the corner with a little smirk on his face. <laughs> You could see the hatred in his eyes, but he kept to himself. He showed no emotion. He wasn't sad when he saw Nolan dead on the ground. But I don't know. It's just those those footsteps, man. They're big and they're heavy. And James is an emotionless man most of the time. But his roommate, we were seeing him dead on the floor. The man doesn't even break a tear. So it was James, baseball shooting, who killed Nolan Landers. Michigan.
please, God, he's my best friend. And someone really had the audacity to kill him. 